on November 1st, 2020 at 3.44 in the morning. <clears throat> Pop-Up MC was open to the public with a number of bugs, glitches, and issues as it was still very much in beta. But it wasn't until 5.11 p.m. that the server was published to Planet Minecraft, along with uh, three other server listing sites. At 11.22 p.m., Moonpals found the listing on Planet Minecraft and joined, who was inadvertently the server's very first player. Moon chatted a bit, but then tried to find a place to build a home. At 11.54 p.m., Expand joined. Moon and Expand worked through quite a number of bugs. For example, instead of being randomly spawned, they started at World Center and could not teleport without costly commands and high cooldowns, which was an oversight on my part. Skeleton horses spawned all the time, and the monster count was far too high. Nevertheless, they managed to find each other and built the very first house on the server. Today, that house is preserved as a server landmark. Expand was the reason Moon logged in every day. He was fun and an awesome player. Moon and Expand logged in every day after 5 p.m. and would play to 6 p.m. It was during this time that they worked together on a house, expanded on it, <clears throat> and Expand even found some flowers to give the moon, which she admired greatly. However, Expand stopped logging in after four days. Moon would never see him again. Moon continued to log in for several more days, building the house and exploring the caves underneath, waiting for Expand to return. But he never did. Eventually, Moon stopped logging in, and we wouldn't see her again for a long while. Span finally made a return mid-November, and would log in a couple of days to find Moon no longer there. Moon had laid down, Moon had laid down a trail of blocks as a parting gift from the server. So, Span did the same, laying down a trail of blocks next to Moon's. These block trails can still be seen today. To this day, Expand never logged back in, but the story doesn't stop here. On December 12th, the server's first player would return, but only briefly. <clears throat> Moon had broken her wrist, so she could only play for a short time. She and Nub teamed up briefly before she logged off. She wouldn't really make a big return until December 25th, when she rejoined the server as a regular player. December 25th is when the server was full of players, up to 15 people on at the same time. It was at this time Moon learned she was the very first player, to which she was very excited and very shocked. This is where Moon's second house used to be. And she later had a third house that used to be up underneath here. But problems started to happen, and Moon got banned. I'm not really going to go into all the reasons why, but it needed to be done, and things fell apart really fast. January 18th, 2021, Moon was banned, and I cried that day for being put into a position where I had to ban the very first player. A year or so in the future, I may lift the ban and allow her to rejoin. This is the final house that Moon had. before she was finally banned, having a total of four houses on the server since she first started. Well, that's all for this episode. Thanks for watching and bye.